Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you how you can search uh, in SharePoint for just the contents of the document. Let me explain to you what I'm talking about. So um, pretty simple scenario here. I have this board site. I have some document library called board documents, and I have a bunch of documents. Typically, of course, you would have lots more documents and you know folders and so on. And I need to find a document um, and I only need to find a document uh, where inside of the document I have the word accounting. All right. Now, obviously, when I type in the word accounting into the search box, it does find me many more documents. Why? Because SharePoint search is super powerful. Uh, when you type something into the search box, it searches the file name. It searches the folder name. It does search inside of the document as well. It also searches any metadata. So if I had a column, let's say with department names and one of them would be accounting uh, and essentially just, yeah, will show you, show me all the documents that are tagged against accounting. So the search in SharePoint is pretty powerful, but you know what, for my particular use case, I don't need any of this, all right? I just need the documents uh, that have word accounting inside of them. Uh, that's all. I don't need anything else, any other files that might have maybe a, 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 the word accounting in their file name. So obviously, again, when I uh, type this in, uh, it shows me a lot more than I, I need, right? It shows me um, the documents for the file name with this particular keyword and so on. So how do we only search for documents that contain the keyword? Essentially, we want to isolate from search the file name, folder name, or any metadata we might have. All you need to do is just type in this body, and then colon, and then the word you're looking for. Uh, this is actually um, called a keyword uh, query language, KQL, right? We are relying on this managed property called body. And uh, essentially, yeah, when I, uh, when I click enter, I only get one document. Remember, I think I had like four before. Why? Because it only found me the documents that contain this particular keyword inside. Let's find out. Let's check. I open this document and look at this. Even though the file name of the document says, you know, test document three or something like that, um, it uh, did find me this document. Why? Because I have this particular keyword inside. All right. Uh, it ignored all the other documents. So this is super helpful, super helpful if, um, you know, if you're searching, if you have lots and lots of documents, uh, hundreds, thousands of documents, uh, and you are maybe searching for a particular keyword, particular string inside um, of your, you know, maybe one of your documents, this is super helpful because the search will then ignore all those other file names and, you know, maybe some folder names, and you're really going to get the results uh, you need. And by the way, you can use this trick. Uh, obviously, I use this trick on, uh, you know, on a SharePoint document library. Uh, you can also use this trick pretty much uh, from anywhere. You at, at the site level, all right. You can search at the site level. You can search uh, globally. Let's just say, you know, what I have no idea where my document is, which site, which uh, library. Uh, you go to your global, you know, kind of uh, to, to the SharePoint start page, which searches everything. And I can do the same thing. I can uh, just type in, you know, the same thing I just typed in. And in this case, you can see, I mean, it still finds me a lot more because I'm searching everything. But you know what? I just need the files and look at this. Uh, essentially, it uh, finds me now uh, all the files that contain this particular keyboard. Uh, all right. And obviously, since we just recently, I recently accessed and uploaded this document, here it is again. All right. So a uh, very powerful um, search trick, in my opinion. Uh, hopefully, you found this trick uh, helpful. Uh, as always, um, you know, happy to see you on my uh, YouTube channel as well as my blog, SharePointMaven.com. And uh, meet you again on my YouTube channel again. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Bye-bye.